Hey guys, we are in front of my room here in Berlin in this shared apartment I'm living in since over two years now and I'd like to show you my room and also my new setup so let's jump in here. Everything starts automatically. This is how I like it. I set everything up with like smart home speakers as well as lights. Let's jump into it. Oh, this is the setup tour. So we're starting off right away with my main workstation. This is basically the, like the, my dream desk. This is actually all powered by a single cable, super clean. This runs all the hard drives, everything. It fits super neat on this desk. By the way, daily driver is my iPhone 11. Um, which you probably have seen on my Instagram if you're following me. Fresh. <laughs> Fun fact, I like to keep water. Mostly it's more than this, but uh, I like to keep water around the house. You got this bottle, we got one here, and one in my backpack. So I'm drinking a lot of liquid. I cannot stress this enough. Drink water and stay high. Drain it! Probably the coolest thing about this desk I haven't even shown you. I mean, it's a stand-up desk as you can see, but it's also electrified so this desk can automatically go into seating position and stand up position go a little to this side um nothing special except this bed has wheels i don't know why um but it has wheels it doesn't even wheel but because it's stuck we got the alarm that wakes me up every morning big tv um oh yeah outside view check this out Take a little look out here. Guys, we got beautiful Berlin. This is city center here. Check this out. I mean, there's always stuff going on in this neighborhood here. That's why I like it. Let's hustle. Oh, this is white light. It looks really yellow now after all this colorful stuff. Um, but I think this is more professional for this um, setup tour. So let's, let me take you to the main part. It's in this corner here and it is all my equipment, basically. I'm super happy how this turned out. I'm super happy I have this corner here in this apartment, in this room. Let's start with the camera bag. This is my camera bag right here. I will link it below. By the way, all, if you, every, anything I'm talking about is linked in the description. If you find anything that is like super rare and uh, you're like, yo, I want to have this, um, you'll find it in the description. This bag is great. Yeah, I don't have to show you this. It's a workhorse. I had, this, I had the last one which broke, but these things are tough. I don't know how I broke it. Let's start at the top of the shelf, actually. Yeah, this is a huge bowl of stuff. Funniest thing in here is my first ever mobile phone. This thing is really, uh, yeah, you could take this off and take the battery out and it's, it's, it's crazy. Um, you probably recognize this camera if you've been all anywhere around YouTube filmmaking. This is the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema 4K. Um, yeah, great camera, really a uh, beautiful piece of, um, I mean, it has its downsides, like the battery, but I'm super cool with that. Like I can actually, this bag, three batteries, five, uh, f five, yeah. And there's two each in these like cameras too. Like I got a lot of batteries, let's put it like that. Um, so yeah, this is the second like magic pocket I got actually. It's super light, there's no cage on it. That's the thing about this one. Um, super tiny lens. This is a, the second black magic I got. This is actually the first I bought, but it's the second of those two. Um, this is fully rigged out with a tilter cage with a follow focus rod here. This is the Nicholas Nano attached to it, which um, as you know, I can control wireless focus from this camera when it's on my gimbal. Gimbal, I'll sh I will show you in a second. Um, on here we have the trusty old Sigma 18 to 35 combined with a speed boot, Metabone speed booster ultra super great combo you get an f-stop of what like 1.2 crazy um yeah on here obviously uh nd filter you need those actually just recently got mine like mm, one two three months ago um but now i'm in the nd game i'm cool um <laughs> continuing with lenses um as you know, before Blackmagic, I've been on Sony, and this is actually the only Sony-only mount lens I have. Uh, it kind of equals to this one. I love wide-angle lenses, so this is a super wide lens, this is a super wide lens, but this is only on Sony, like I said, APS-C. Um, my Sony's I still have here. 
a6300 rigged out with a cage um yeah whenever there's a use case for it i will use it but i'm mostly shooting on the black magic that is why i am actually selling this a6500 now I'm trying to get rid of it because i'm just thinking for professional cameras not even counting gopro and drone that's a little much um so i'm getting rid of one maybe two and adding a new one to the collection soon guys before we jump into the next section of equipment i want to talk to you about audio today's video is actually sponsored by sennheiser i'm super glad to say that maybe you guessed it it's a lavalier it's a wireless microphone look i'm back here and you can still hear me properly hello hello check this out you stay here guys this is like a walkie-talkie i'm like in the living room i'm in a different loop right now i'm walking down the steps i'm on a staircase i'm like in a different on a different level in this apartment and i'm still talking to you all right recording now is this little guy the sennheiser xs wireless it's a super compact small and tiny really tiny this is the thing basically this is the thing there's a lavalier wireless microphone whatever you want to call it it is right here you maybe have noticed yeah on reverse side it looks like this i'm on thank you for helping me out with the shoot um we got this little guy on here it is super easy it's really just this cable going to the camera and that's it um guys super dope thing about this i don't know much about audio and this thing is really easy to set up it's four parts it's one transmitter one receiver you just plug the cable into one thing screw it together it's super secure with the screw i haven't ever seen that before that is super dope um attach it to somewhere you should be wearing like something black dark whatever hide it somewhere super easy to set up just press power on the receiver power on the transmitter automatically connects it's easy it's simple like that full transparency i got this thing sent out this is a paid uh, promotion by them if you want to check that thing out it's top of the description um i can highly recommend this super dope easy let's move on it's just a little thing it's not really equipment but it's also a room tour so it's a self-made it just it motivates me like you know i sleep here this way i wake up seeing self-made and like it reminds me of being self-made and um living the dream i'm basically living the dream yo let's talk about this little guy i mean you saw the 2019 macbook pro what is this old guy doing here it's the 2014 um macbook pro which was my daily driver just a month ago and all this thing is doing now power oh yeah oh that was unplugged okay so all that this little setup here is doing it's still a powerful machine don't get me wrong but this is uploading stock footage and huge files to dropbox because you know i want to preserve the battery life on the old one so i don't want to have them like running overnight so this is what this guy is for and basically like i don't know when friends are over they can you can totally edit on this like full like 1080p and more um so it's this guy easy as you can see i'm trying to keep things organized um i'm kind of maybe doing a good job i mean not on every part of this thing but uh yeah so we have another huge box of stuff this is actually super heavy and there's a lot of stuff in here I put like a little hole in here, which all the cables go through. This ends up here and I'm gonna show you behind the scenes. This is like my charging shelf, right? I can put all my batteries in here. Different cameras, drone, yeah, everything you need basically. Android phone, yep. <laughs> Moving down, um, a whole box of GoPro stuff, which actually replaced my GoPro with this little guy, the DJI Osmo Pocket, Osmo Action 4K, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, have not, been able to shoot a vlog on this thing this has amazing image quality that is super fine to grade um but yeah i'm waiting for the right moment comment soon though i have some trips planned in november moving down lowest shelf ronin s this thing is a workhorse that can carry a lot like this is for the heavy workloads 3.5 kilos i think something like that um i totally rigged this thing out we have a a quick release plate on here which allows me to mount cameras really quickly and then uh, get rid of them uh, we got see this situation here 
I only put the focus wheel on here. Fun, this is a this is a really quick tip here. Put the focus wheel on the Ronin S and then you get another power outlet. That goes to here, this little cable, and it actually powers through micro USB, powers the Nucleus N. Focus wheel, which actually needs batteries that are running out in like four hours. So um, this thing is key, just charges from the Ronin S. This is for the big camera, like I said, brought this heavy guy here to three kilos. And ah, I still, you might be asking why, but I still have this guy, the Crane V2. This is old school, like this is one of the first Xeon cranes. And um, this thing actually fits on here. So this thing without a cage with this small lens fits on there perfectly. Super happy to still have the ability to have such a small and compact gimbal. Cannot forget about the holy grail of ever stabilization, like um, not using this at all <laughs> gotta be honest i just restabilized it though um for the black magic so i'm trying to get it back in action uh this is the glide cam for uh, 2000 hd 2000 actually um tripod we all need a tripod nothing special about that oh my goodness this is a thing i don't use enough a shoulder rig completely customized everything like every part here is handpicked from amazon i completely built this myself same quick release plate obviously so i can switch them quickly um nucleus n also goes on here all right guys one last thing in this corner this thing major key get yourself from amazon it is called jewelry organizers i use it for cable management isn't that sick i can totally fold this thing together put it in the suitcase and have all my cables with me this is kind of help me organizing things and yeah let's move out of this corner we got the infamous the thing where you throw your clothes on. I mean, so many of you, you probably know this. This thing holds clothing and I think we pretty much do. This is my room in Berlin, living here since over two years now. <laughs> Guys, I hope you enjoyed this little video, little insight into my setup. Like I said, everything you're interested in is down in the description. Um, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.